Hey guys, it's Tyson back, back with another video. Today I'm going to show you how to do something really cool with your phone if you have Linux. So, I wonder if you've ever tried to like connect your phone to Linux in, in a different way or something cool, and I want to show you that that's actually possible. So, first off, on your computer, what you're going to need to download, go to this store and type in KDE Connect. And once that pops up, just click on it and you can install that and open it and stuff. So once you're in there, you'll see it's just kind of this little app, whatever. There's not much to do on the computer. But what there is, is you want to do it on your phone. So if I go to my phone here, and if I open up KDE Connect, I have added the Linux PC, which is this computer, as one of the options. So I'm going to click on that. And then I got a bunch of different options here. So the first one that I thought was really cool is if I go on my computer and like open files and like pictures um, and like open something like maybe this image right here. What I can do is I can go on the remote input on my phone. Um, I mean the slideshow remote. And I can go through the different ones. And one of the coolest features here, I'll show you. If I click this big button right here, it has this little spinning circle thing. You're like, what is that? Well, if I move my phone around like this, it actually controls it. So it's a little laser pointer if you're trying to show someone something in a photo or something. So this is actually really helpful. So it, it's pretty cool. And so then one of the other options that I like, it's I probably would actually use this as this little remote input thing. So this is actually crazy. So here on the bottom part of the screen, what you do is you move your finger around it and it's being a little laggy because of network issues. But um, there we go. It's nice and smooth. This is a trackpad that I can use. So I can use this to open things, whatever. Um, then the other cool thing is up here, this is a scroll wheel, so I can use this to scroll. Like if I go to, um, like if I open Brave here, and I type in, oh, I can also use the keyboard. I type in like Tesla. I can go to images. And then I can use a scroll wheel to look through all these awesome pictures. So. It's really cool and really handy. So if you want to learn how to do that, I can leave the link to the app down in the description. Um, and you will need to download it on your phone. I think this works a little bit better on Android just because iOS has some limitations. But it still works pretty fine on iOS. So thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. And tell us what you thought in the comments.